say, Ethan? Nothing. I said daddy went to play with his friends. Anyways, hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Allie, if you're new to my channel. And welcome to Beauty with a Purpose. are new to my channel i upload three videos a week beauty bible and lifestyle today is a lifestyle video so if any of that interests you please go ahead and hit that subscribe button and let's get into today's video so anyways today is going to be a vlog and you guys you guys i already like started my day it is now 11 56 i've cleaned up the kitchen which wasn't dirty i just had to do dishes Watered the backyard, got the boys dressed, threw all of their bed stuff in the washer because it was it's been about a month since I washed their bedding. And then I worked out, did part of my did part of my Bible reading for today. So now that I'm done working out, I'm gonna go ahead and wash my face. You can see I'm still kind of red from my workout. I'm gonna go ahead and wash my face and do my skincare. And I just thought that I would share some of that with you guys because I haven't <laughs> done that in a while. So today is actually gonna be um, my exfoliating day. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in with my Dr. Brandt uh, Microdermabrasion Age Defying Exfoliator. And we're just gonna go ahead and use this to exfoliate our skin. And I always use like lukewarm water. I never use cold and I never use hot. Like as close to cold as you can get, but not cold if that makes sense. Anyways, I always go in with my hands first. Excuse me, Ethan, please. I'm working, aren't I? Okay. And then I'm going to take this side of my PMD and just finish doing that. And I'm going to take the vibrating ones just to really get that in there. Make sure my fingers aren't using up all the exfoliators. I did my sister's makeup yesterday. And oh my gosh, her skin looks so flipping flawless. I thought I would do like a just do a speed thing of me getting ready with you guys. So, okay, now we're gonna rinse that off. Okay, guys, and nothing's changed with my morning time face wash. I still use the high, the Neutrogena Hydra Boost Hydrating Cleansing Gel. This is my favorite. I take two cups, and then I start on the slow, on the slow vibrator side. King, what, what are you crying about? Ethan, come get your tablets. And I'll go over my whole face with it going slow. Let's see how tan I'm getting. Now I'll speed it up and just do it really fast. One silver. Because I usually don't have a lot of time in the morning to just stay in here. So once I speed it up, I speed up on how fast I'm going around my face. And once it's nice and sudsy like this, I rinse it off. Really get any places that I feel like I'm getting pimples or breaking out or where I go over those places pretty rough. Not rough, but like pretty intense, I guess. Now I'm gonna rinse this off. Okay, now that that's off, we're just gonna pat our face dry. Okay, so now I'm going to take two cotton pads and go in with my witch hazel, and I'm going to clean my face and my armpits with this. Cause now that I use a natural deodorant, it does make a big difference if you go in and at least clean them with witch hazel every day and just help get out all those impurities. And it will also help your body detox all the aluminum and chemicals from other deodorant that you have used so really nasty for my workout because i did do my skincare last night and then just go in and gently wipe your armpits okay so for my moisturizer i still go in with the garnier moisture rescue and this is the normal one normal to oily or just normal yeah just normal combo skin this is the one that I use. My skin isn't as dry as it once used to be. I don't know if it's because I take better care of it now. I don't try to remember to do a sheet mask at least two to three times a week. So, so now I'm going in with my Dr. Brandt eye cream. This I don't know if you guys can tell, but like my dark circles are seriously like not that bad anymore at all. Now that's probably casting a shadow on me. You can't tell, but not that bad at all. One thing I have switched up now that I'm spending a little more time outside with the boys is I do go on with my Pureless, um, Pureless Blue Lotus Daily Moisturizer with SPF 30. And I like this because it doesn't smell like the sunscreen smell does not stay on your face. And also this doesn't blend in white. So it's good for makeup. 
and it smells more like flowers than it does sunscreen. So I have been going in with this. I like the way that this one smells. Like I said, it smells more like that blue lotus than it does anything else. I always shake it every time before I put it on. And now I'll just go in with my EOS and apply a little bit of this just to prep my lips. My lips are finally not chapped anymore from getting sunburned. And now I'll go in with, and I use the Schmitz Charcoal and Magnesium one. I like the lavender one and yeah, it's good to smell, but I got this one just in case Brian wanted to try it. But I mean, it doesn't smell bad. It just keeps like, it doesn't really smell like anything. It just keeps odor from coming in. I'm gonna go ahead and pick up my outfit for the day. So I'm going to get dressed and then you guys can join me for doing my makeup. <laughs> had chicken nuggets and corn. Brian and I are having leftovers. I'm gonna eat and then get out and about. Okay. What'd you eat? Um, 
corn and chicken nuggets. Was it yummy? Yes. Yes. What did you drink? Um, chocolate milk. Can I see? Nice. Hey guys, so I have sucked at vlogging today mostly because my phone was dying all day long. So basically all we did was drive around town all day to try to find a side-by-side -side refrigerator with the InstaView door. Couldn't find that anywhere, so we're probably going to have to end up ordering one. And then Brian surprised me, he pulled up to Target, but Target like had lines outside to go in and then we had all the boys with us. And so he was like, all right, go inside and get your Mother's Day gift. And I was like, what are you talking about? And he finally got me my Apple Watch. Look, I'm so excited. I had I had flirted with the idea of wanting one. And then I was like, no, I don't want one. And then I got my little fitness tracker. And I was like, oh, I think I do want an Apple Watch. And so like for the past few months, I've been asking him for an Apple Watch. And he finally got it for me. So I'm super excited. But we are here, or I am here, right now by myself, picking up some wing stop. Yeah, so if you guys didn't know or haven't been paying attention, Texas is open for business at 25% capacity. Basically, like, the only things that aren't open are, like, the gym, which is what everybody needs, is a gym, which is annoying. So, yeah, so we are here and certain businesses are just kind of doing it to like their own standards so you can't dine in and wing stop yet but i am here to pick up our food so i'm about to go out here and do that and then i will see you guys whenever i get back home okay so now we are about to head home they were crazy busy my food was supposed to be ready at 9 10. it's well, it was only five minutes late i was early so yeah let's go ahead and go home Outside light, so let me try to hurry up before the car lights turn on. Oh, dang it! Hi, hi, you may call me baby. You may call me baby. Mm -hmm. Hi, Mama. Hi. You Oh, 
Cajun corn. If you have not tried their Cajun corn, try it. Famous fries to be dipped in ranch, not ketchup. And then we got 24 piece barbecue, lemon pepper, garlic parmesan, and the ranch. Mm. That is not the ocean. That's water in a bowl. Stop. What is that trash in there? Check that out. Um, I'm just kidding. You guys, I suck at vlogging. I need to really get back into vlogging every day. So I'll, we basically. <laughs> Or every other day. Every other day? That's what we all She's so fine, though. Ooh, Brian. Yep. So, anyways, you guys, um, we we watched all three of Back to the, all three of the Back to the Future movies. I thought they were good. They were funny. Um, but yeah, we watched all of those after we while we were eating our dinner, and then. I just, we came to the room, I took a shower, did my nighttime skincare routine. Nothing's different other than I go in and add this Ulta Beauty Jelly, Joyful Jelly Overnight Sleeping Mask, and then my Elemis Superfood Moisturizer. And then tonight, I'm going to be using this Collagen Essence Mask. This is another one of my masks that I got at the Asian Food Mart. So, yeah. We are going to call it a night. I will be vlogging tomorrow just because this vlog will be really short if I don't. So we will see you guys in the morning. Bye -bye. <laughs> Good night. It's the next day. It's 11.38. I wanted to show you guys these that I've actually been using every night before bed that I forgot to show you guys last night. I need to eat. I'm feeling dizzy. And I've been going in with this cuticle oil every night just to kind of help take care of my um cuticles because they really dry and then they get like that skin right there like i don't know you could just tell my cuticles are terrible and then if you have dry feet use this this healed like i had chunks of skin missing out of my feet sorry if it sounds gross and this had it like getting better within a week and you use this at morning and night and that's what i've been using and i really really like it so Anyways, I am ow, I am still in my bed clothes, so I'm about to find something to wear. I got all the boys dressed, got the house straightened up, really just had to fix our beds since I didn't have to cook dinner. And now I'm just going to find something to wear. I'm debating on if I want to match the boys or not. Kind of do, kind of don't. I don't know. We shall see what I decide to put on. Okay, so this is what I came up with. I got my little American Eagle jeans, my little oversized shirt from Target, and I just um, tied it up with a little chungle ponytail holder, whatever you want to call it. And then I'm just doing, you know, the classic half up, half down, which I really feel like would look better once I do my makeup and stuff. I'm probably going to do something a little bit natural. But yeah, this is what it is. I don't, I'm not sure what shoes I'm going to wear yet. Might be my cheap little Target Universal Thread shoes. Or I might wear my Jordans because I have all of the boys in Jordans. And I would kind of want to match them a little bit since I decided not to match them with how I dress. And I just wanted to be a little bit more casual, cute, cute cash. Ooh, ooh. Yeah. Got my little yummy Mother's Day lunch from Olive Garden. It's my choice. Watching some living single and enjoying time with my boo and my babies that are awake. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why do you have on daddy's shoe? <laughs> you are so funny to my mom's house after we ate i went to sleep got up did a quick little makeup look now we're at my mom's house for my sister's birthday slash mother's day and i'm not gonna record in here because they have a lot of company that i'm not sure is okay being on camera but yeah we're at my mom's house so we're just gonna go ahead and 
going here, celebrate Mother's Day a little bit. I'll get some snippets of the food and stuff, but like actual recording, I'm not gonna do that because there's a lot of guests here that I don't think would be comfortable being on my channel. So why the boys love coming to grandma's house. I'm going to vlog my sister vlogging. Vlogging, my sister okay, vlogging. Chrissy. Mimi. Okay, I'll prop you out, okay? Right. What is this on? I don't know, but it's going worldwide. Okay. Worldwide. 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 Oh, girl, you got like two different clips already. <laughs> okay, guys, so I just wanted to show you guys the nighttime, what I add to my nighttime skincare routine. And this is the little... Thing that I was talking about that's the only thing different that I do at nighttime and then the lip sleeping mask I'm actually going to do another mask tonight I'm going to do the I don't know what mango does I need to look that up I'm going to be doing the strawberry one tonight because my skin is freaking out I have a lot of texture all over it and we left my mom's pretty early we got there at about 5 30 we left at about 7 30 or so um a little earlier than 7 30 but my stomach was just hurting so bad and if you guys didn't know i have a hernia and it's just like anything can set it off at any moment playing with my kids pants that are too tight foods drinks anything can set it off at any moment um most usually it's always like working out but here recently a lot of stuff has been making it just act up so that started hurting really bad. We came home. Um, I sat down for a little bit, ate some ice cream, went to shower the boys. And after that, I had like a migraine. And so I used um, some Young Living oil. It's called a Copaiba oil. And I will show you guys after this. But um, put a few drops over under my tongue. And my headache is subsiding. but the her And the hernia pain is subsiding. But they're both definitely still there. So, Brian's actually in the living room watching The Last Dance, I think it's called. It's the um, Chicago Bull story and, um, on ESPN. So, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to read a few sections of my divine design because our last study group is actually this Tuesday. We're hoping to meet in person. And then I'm also going to do, and I'll put a picture of on my screen. It's called Read and Write Truth. And this month's is over anxiety and fear, but it speaks to me in a different way. I mean, you don't only have to do it if you're, if you only if you have anxiety and fear because any scripture could talk to you in any way and I think that that's beautiful so I'm going to get that done I usually do this in the morning but you know like 
kind of rested, but I definitely don't want to end my day without taking the time to spend with God. So that's what I'm going to go ahead and do right now. I'm going to spend some time with God. Um, I'll show you guys at least me doing at least just the read and write truth part. And then, yeah, and then I'll show you guys that oil. And I think I'm going to go ahead and call it a night. <laughs> but yeah, so yeah, let's go ahead and get into, you know, like just reading and writing the word. And we will go from there. Okay, you guys, so my storage had got full, but basically this is all I do is I pick four colors. I pick a color to write in. I pick a color to refer anytime the Bible is referring to me as a follower of Christ. And then I pick a color for anytime it refers to God the Father. And then I usually pick another color anytime it's speaking or referencing Jesus. So let me find one that has like, so for instance, this one, Jesus is blue. Anytime it refers to me, it's in pink. And then anytime it refers to God the Father, it's in that darker green color. And that's just the reason I use all the different colors. And then I'll go in and circle things that stood out or box things that stood out to me. And then I put down at the bottom what the scripture spoke to me or anything like that and that's just what I've been doing and like I said I'm gonna go ahead and pop the thing up on the screen again so go ahead and screenshot it so that way you guys can join me in on this follow me on social media because I do send out like a daily reminder and yeah I'm gonna finish up this study now and importing some footage because my storage got full and then I will get back with you guys to show you guys the oil and to go to bed the oil that I was talking about for pain and it really takes it away within about 30 to 30 minutes to an hour you'll be feeling a lot better you just put a few drops under your tongue these are the young living ones so when it comes to my health like something that I may need for allergies or just something internal I will buy the young living brand but for like just sensing like making my home smell good I will use this brand off of Amazon and you get all of these oils for like 28 bucks and whereas these oils are more expensive and that's why if it's for my health i will invest in these but just to like make my home smell good i will buy these ones all right you guys so now with all of that being said i'm going to bed i love you guys i'm ending this vlog so i love you guys or oh, that jesus loves you more if you haven't already please go ahead and give me a thumbs up also hit that subscribe button and i will see you guys in my next video bye guys Mwah.